This is the example on slide 66 of our chapter 14 PowerPoint. Um, and the question asks, a vinegar solution has a hydroxide concentration, that's what those little brackets around the OH mean, of 5 times 10 to the negative 12 molar. And remember, molar is moles of solute over liters of solution. What is the hydronium concentration, H3O plus concentration, of the vinegar solution? And is the vinegar solution acidic, basic, or neutral? So hopefully you've had a chance to look at the past couple slides and we learned um, a new formula. So I have it written right here on the slide, I'm highlighting it. KW, which is the equilibrium constant for water, that's what the W stands for, is equal to the concentration of um, hydronium, H3O+, plus, times the concentration of hydroxide, OH-. Minus. And this KW is equal to 1 times 10 to the negative 14. So what we can do with this equation is if we're given one of the components, H3O plus or OH minus, we can rearrange and solve for the other. So I'm looking for H3O plus in this case. I have OH minus, and I also have the KW, which is always 1 times 10 to the negative 14. <laughs> so to rearrange this, I'm going to divide this expression by H3O plus to get OH by itself. And that's going to give me, oh, and I made a mistake there. I apologize. We already know what OH is. What we're trying to do is get H3O by itself. My apologies. So we're going to divide by OH minus on both sides to get H3O plus by itself because that's what we're looking for, not OH minus. So therefore, our hydronium concentration is equal to KW over our hydroxide concentration. KW, which is stated up here in the problem, is 1.0 times 10 to the negative 14. It's always going to be that number anytime we're dealing with it. And our hydroxide concentration, it tells us in the problem, is this 5.0 times 10 to the negative 12. 5.0 times 10 to the negative 12. So then if we divide those two numbers by one another, we get that H3O plus is equal to, we get that it's equal to 0, oops, 0 0.002, and that's in units of molar, or if you want to be in scientific notation, 2.0 times 10 to the negative 3, I believe. So, the second part of the question asks us, is it acidic, basic, or neutral. So if something's acidic, that means that we have a higher concentration of H3O plus compared to hydroxide. If something's basic, H3O plus is less than the hydroxide concentration, and if something is neutral, they're both equal. So if we compare the 5 times 10 to the negative 12 and the 2 times 10 to the negative 3, H3O con plus concentration is much larger, oops, much larger than our hydroxide concentration. Therefore, my solution is acidic. 